Right, this week is episode three. I'm gonna give it everything I've got today to try and catch this skill. Um, feeling a bit bad after yesterday, it was a heavy session. Kind of feel like I went 12 rounds with Mike. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna do everything I can. We'll see how we get on. Shoulder, I tweaked the shoulder a little bit last Friday. So I had to manage that over the weekend. I've got through all of my training so far this week. Um, it was very tight yesterday after the session, so I just iced it up. It's feeling better today. We're gonna to do what we can. Um, I feel all right. So I think I feel better than probably the last two weeks. So so I get back in the gym as well. So that's gonna give me a boost. He's been a little bit ill recently, which is a bit shit, bless him. But uh, he's back in the gym. We've got that buzz back and I'm gonna try and go for it. my pad man decided to salt that mat just randomly <laughs> in the middle of high bar Loosen the bar to manipulate what I'm doing. Normally I tighten it. But casino, I need to move the bar a little bit more. Starting to get pissed off, that's a good sign. I had a coach when I was younger, and he used to say, oh, you just gotta piss you off, and then you're just awesome. I used to be crap on pommel when I was a kid. I remember one British, we started on pommel. I fell twice. I was fucking, I was angry. I didn't speak to anyone after that, and then I won, I won, I won the next four pieces in a row. <laughs> I think I finished second on the last one. I finished like second all, all round, I think. And he was like, that's what we need to do. We just need to get you angry every competition. <laughs> now I like to spend my life being calm, and meditating. Maybe I need to channel that in, in a aggressive child in me again. So yeah. Frustrated a little bit, but realistically, I've not put in the numbers. Um, like I said, tweaked my shoulder last week. I haven't been able to get enough sessions in. But now uh, I'm yeah. going to up the numbers as much as I possibly can. I need to be careful as well because the volume in terms of like my routine preparation has just gone up. Next week I start routines. My first week of routines. But and, and this it's not going to be. It was never going to be easy. This skill, pretty much for me, it's a real personal thing. I've always wanted to compete this skill before you know, I finish and get it solid in a routine that I compete consistently. And like, if I've got a chance of going, you know, to the Olympic Games next year, this has got to be in the routine. There's no two ways about it. So there's only one way, that's forward. I'm not going to look back. And yeah, I'm just going to keep grinding. Hopefully, you know, each week we take a step forward and get a bit closer. Um, but I need to get the numbers in before next week now. Um, if I, you know, I'm just missing that height. The height's not there. And the only way I can do that is just by getting the numbers and getting more, you know, when you're learning a new skill, it almost needs to, you need to go through so many different stages and it almost needs to become 
like automatic, like normalized, like you don't think about it. Like I don't think, I don't wake up and think, right, I've got casino. It's just, it's part of the routine. It takes a long time to get to that stage, but uh, yeah, it's gonna be a hard one, this one, but I'm up for the fight. Thanks for watching.